Is mold eating you out of house and home, collecting on your clothes, your shoes, and your furniture? Well, in this video, we're going to review a product that might help you out with that. Welcome everybody to another great review with It Came From China and in this video we're going to be reviewing these desiccant bags from AliExpress. Now there's a bit of a backstory to this review. Last summer my family and I moved out into the countryside and we're surrounded by farmland and it's lovely and lush and green and we had a lovely warm summer but then the winter arrived and it got cold and dark and wet, very wet. The circle of time carried on turning though, as it does, the seasons changed and spring arrived, the sunshine and the bunnies and the warm air and some birds started to sing and so on. But with the warm air came the mold. The moisture had been in the air, now everything started to flower and we found mold on shoes, on clothes, on furniture, literally in all weird corners of the house. So we had to suddenly combat this. Aside from cleaning it, we had to find a way to stop this mold. So I started thinking about dehumidifiers, for example, and looked on AliExpress and found out that there are a few of these kind of things you can buy. Some of them are electric, some are battery operated. There's different styles, but now I've got to worry about batteries. I've got to worry about an electricity bill, for example. So I started thinking about these desiccant bags. You know, these little white bags that come in your clothes and your food and your shoes when you buy them, your earth moving equipment, for example. And they say, do not eat, throw away. These may harm you, they may kill you, they may raise your house to the ground. Now, I'd always been scared of these things as a kid, wondering maybe if my insides would shrivel up like a raisin and they would quite, quite literally kill me. However, I started thinking about these as a potential solution to the problem and thinking maybe I could buy hundreds of these on AliExpress and scatter them throughout the house like little surprise Easter eggs. But as I did some searching, I found out that there's something similar but a little bit more geared towards household use. And that is this giant desiccant bag. So let's go ahead and unpack it. And it's something that's specifically geared towards household mold. If we unpack the, uh, the actual item, it's got a little hook here so that it attaches to the top so you can hang it in your wardrobe. But basically, it is a giant bag of those little white silica gel desiccants in the top portion of the product. And in the bottom, there's a little area to go ahead and absorb and contain the water that's been pulled out of the, uh, out of the air, the actual moisture that's been pulled out of the air to put inside you. And I'll admit I was a little skeptical at first when I saw the photos on the, uh, on the actual product page and you see lots of water in these bags and I thought maybe it would help a little. I certainly wasn't expecting it to get as much water as seems to be in the actual uh, uh, container in these videos. But I bought a few of these products and I thought let's try them out. Let's see if we can at least get some kind of beneficial use. And I put these into the closet um, about four weeks ago or so, once the spring had already arrived, much less moisture, already starting to get quite a bit warmer as well. And I thought, let's see what they do. After a month of use though, we've got a considerable amount of water in the bag, way more than I expected and pretty much exactly as advertised on the, uh, on the actual web page itself. Now, this is not the cleanest looking water. In fact, now that I've been shaking it a bit, it's starting to get even murkier. So I wouldn't drink this. I wouldn't give it to my kids. I'm not even sure I would feed the potted plants this kind of water, for example. But in terms of pulling the uh, moisture out of the air, there is at least probably 250 mils here. And it could easily fill a cup. And I've been shocked that this is hanging in my closet, pulling this kind of water out of the air. Now, I've used these for about a month. And the top part, the, uh, the actual... Uh, balls have started to st stick together here and coagulate and form these little clumps, for example. So I'm probably done with this one. Luckily, I bought another. I'm going to go and hang that in the closet once I'm finished recording. But you seem to get a good month of use out of them. And as you can see, a fairly sizable amount of water been sucked out here as well. So I definitely feel that these are doing some good uh, for the, uh, the actual mold problem that we've had. Now, price-wise, they're around $2 a, a pop, so certainly not going to break the bank to go ahead and buy a couple of these and maybe put them in the kitchen, in the bathrooms, in the laundry room. And with a nice hook, you can go ahead and hang them in the closet as well. So it's worth getting a couple of these if you do have a mold problem at home and you want to try and address it in some way, shape or form. Packaging-wise, they come sealed in a, uh, a reasonably airtight bag, so moisture is not going to get it into them en route, for example, or before you're ready to use them in the next season, for example. And in terms of overall quality, they certainly seem to have done the job, pulled a lot of moisture out of the, uh, out of the, out of the air. 
So should you chuck them? Should you check them out? Or should you go ahead and charge them? Now, again, this product's not going to be for everybody, but if you have a mold problem, I would say definitely charge them. Go ahead and buy a couple. Put them in the house and see if you can get some use out of them. Maybe start with one or two at $2 a pop. See if they can help. And then you can go ahead and buy more for the next season as well. Of course, as always, your challenge may vary. If you're interested in this exact product, you can go ahead and check the link in the notes for this video itself. But either way, please go ahead and give us a thumbs up on YouTube and be sure to subscribe to our channel to get great reviews every week of what we've been buying from China. Thanks for watching.